What is going on guys? It is Cryptix bringing you another YouTube video today. This is something I've been very excited for for a very long time. Obviously you guys saw the title of the video, so this is the official Logic G Fuel flavor, the Bobby Boysenberry. And I was gonna go on a rant and kind of tell you guys how long and how much of a Logic fan like I've been for a very long time, but I'll just save that for the end of the video. So let's just get right into the unboxing and the review. All right, first off, we got the box. Obviously, I'll give you guys some B-roll. I'm assuming that's Logic with all the boys and berries kind of just flying right past him. I think that's so dope. And another thing I think that's really cool is they actually kind of put him in front of the G Fuel logo, which is this is the first time I've ever seen that. Obviously, on the side, we got the Gamma Labs logo with the berries blasting past it once again. And the back, I think, is so unbelievably sick. I can't even explain it. You guys can see it. I, I'm fully aware of how sick this looks. Opening it up, we got the Bobby Boy shaker. It's a teal lid with, like, a red kind of top thing. And we got the Bobby Boy logo on the shaker as well as kind of, like, a red, blue, and pink G Fuel logo. And then on the inside as well, we have a red insert. Next up, we got the sticker. This sticker is so sick. It kind of gives off like galaxy vibes, if, if that makes sense. I don't really know how else to explain it. It looks like, like a galaxy or universe or something. Something like outer space. And then for the last thing, we got the tub. This tub is so sick. Very similar to the box design. For the purpose of the video, so you guys can see the color, I'm going to be drinking it out of the winter white shaker. I'm not going to drink it out of the normal shaker because I want you guys to be able to see the color. Let's open it up. Unfortunately, the scoop is buried, so we got to go digging. All right, when I smell it, it kind of smells like sour pixel potion. I'm not going to cap. I know it has nothing to do with sour pixel potion because obviously it's. Uh, supposed to be a raspberry mixed with a blackberry i believe and apparently it's an actual thing i thought when i heard boysenberry i thought it was kind of just made just for logic but it's like an actual thing like it's, it's a real thing it's, there's an actual berry called a boysenberry all right boys i got the scoop let's put it in the g fuel shaker make sure i don't make a mess this is a really weird like position to be putting it in that's what she said <laughs> all right let's shake it up all right it's purple it's definitely purple this looks sick I don't even want to keep you guys waiting. I don't want to keep myself waiting. I'm going to smell it real quick. It smells like grape Kool-Aid a little bit. I'm not going to cap, but let's just, let's, let's drink it, dude. Dang. That's like really good. It, there's definitely a berry taste to it. For whatever reason, I get like a slight hype sauce aftertaste, but like when I'm drinking it, it kind of tastes a little like a grape. I know there's not any grape in here, but that's what it tastes like. like. But once again, I've never had a blackberry, so I don't know what blackberries taste like, but to me, it tastes like a grape. So it's like I drink it and it tastes like grape, and then like right after I drink it, or right after I get that grape taste, then there's like a hype sauce aftertaste kind of. That's really good. That's actually really, really good. I gotta give that like a 9 out of 10. It's not a 10 out of 10 because it's not Phase X, it's not Fruit Punch, and it's not classified, but it's like definitely up there. It's it could almost qualify for, for top five. So before I get into my little life story, kind of talking about logic and all that stuff, um, I want to let you guys know you guys can use code Cryptix to cop this G Fuel flavor. You 100% should. And on top of that, I want to thank G Fuel for sending this flavor out to me. It, it means a lot, honestly, uh, considering like little 13 year old me while I was editing and grinding out YouTube videos, I was listening to Logic and it's so dope. The fact that I'm now working with a company that is working with Logic, like if you really think of it from a business standpoint, I'm, a, I'm like business associates with Logic. Obviously, he has no idea who I am, but it's still sick. So now getting in my story. Yeah, I first heard about Logic through FaZe Clan, obviously, like most people in this community did. And right off the bat, I started listening to his music and I loved it. And eventually, I ended up going to one of his concerts. And at the time, I lived in Germany and Logic was not very well known in Germany. So he literally performed in a nightclub. Like a like if you guys ever been to a club, I'm assuming a lot of you haven't, but he literally performed in a nightclub. And it wasn't a big nightclub. There was maybe 400 people at the concert, if even that. Actually, nah, it, it was definitely more like 200. Like, the crowd was probably half the size of a basketball court. And obviously, I got there, like, mad early because I wanted to be front row because it was just general admission. So it was one of the best concerts I've ever been to. And I've been to some really dope concerts. I've seen Kendrick Lamar. I've seen Khalid. I've seen some really, really talented and dope artists. But that Logic concert was definitely probably top three when it comes to concerts I've been to. And I think it's so dope. Looking back on it, and like I was saying earlier, like, how I don't want to say I grew up listening to his music, but, like, eight, nine years ago when I was grinding and, and listening to his music, I'm still listening to it now. And it's just crazy to think about how far I've come in that time period. And throughout that whole time, I was listening to Logic. Honestly, I could sit here for hours and talk about Logic and all that stuff. But before I end the video, I want to give a huge congrats to Logic. This is sick. And I'm super excited to see what your future holds. Obviously, you're not really making music anymore, which you're happy. So that's really all that matters. And I support that as a fan of yours. And I can't wait to see what you do next, whether it's movies or whatever it is. It's going to be dope. I'm excited for it. And I'm going to call it there. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. If Logic somehow ever sees this, I freaking love you, dude. You're dope. But other than that, I'm out. This has been Cryptics. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.